This multi-agent team video for the game Go is a three-part demonstration. In the first screen, the user selects which side is commanded by the agents and which side is commanded by the player. The user must drag the icons representing the user and each individual agent into the appropriate ovals below. Our demo allows selection of the following programs, Fuego and its variants, Nugo, Pachi, and Mogo. Multiple copies of the same program are allowed, but we will start off playing against a diverse team of agents. On the next screen, the user can select the weights for each agent by changing the heights of the bars. The higher the bars, the more weight the agent is given in the voting algorithm. Next, a window will display some statistics, along with another window where the actual game is played. The top chart shows how often the agent's choice was selected, and the bottom chart shows the frequency of the size of the set of agents whose choices were selected. For example, if all the agents disagree, only one of their choices will be the eventual move, and thus the frequency of a size of set 1 goes up by 1. If all four agents agree on the same move, the frequency of a set of size 4 goes up by 1. As you can see, an exciting 9x9 game is being played between the human player as black and the four agents as white. We will return to commentary after the game progresses for a minute. Eventually, both players declare a pass, and the score is calculated. After applying the 6.5 Comey rule, we see that the agents have beaten our player by 11.5 points. A third window is also displayed here. The top chart shows how frequently certain team compositions for the agents were chosen, and the bottom displays the player's victories against these teams. We will now demonstrate the same simulation as before but with copies of the same program, in this case, Fuego. The weights will be the same for all copies. Although they are all the same program with the same weights, the Fuego agents do not always vote for the same move due to random chance, though obviously their moves are more uniform than those in the previous simulation. Note that this team of identical agents may perform weaker than the diverse team, because some agents are stronger than Fuego depending on the board state, even though Fuego is the strongest agent overall. A diverse team is more likely than a uniform team to have an agent, weak or strong, who plays well in a given board state. Although we don't show this in the video, our demo also allows the user to join a team of agents and participate in a voting procedure. We can also have multiple users leading to mixed teams of humans and agents playing against each other. This game ends with the agents barely beating the player by 1.5 points. This concludes the presentation of our demo. Thank you for watching.